Working very hard, Albert from Austria was an engineer for the first time to Taiwan about 30 years ago. If you look back, the installation of the first computed tomography over 35 years ago, and now we have more than over 200 NII and almost 380 computed tomography in Taiwan, Taiwan has become the world's most sophisticated medical institution. Now, Albert not only settled down in Taiwan, but also a senior vice president of the medical group, we call the impression for him such an extraordinary achievement. Because he can see that Taiwan has future, right? From the 70s, he devoted himself to his career. It means that he did dedicate his life to Taiwan. Indeed, he deserved the praise and applause. Taiwan's willingness to the foreigners made him feel close, but when he just came to Taiwan, Taiwan just broke up the diplomatic relation with America, so the atmosphere is not cordial. He was always mistaken for an American. They thought we are American, but certainly we are not, we are Austrian, but they didn't understand. Different that moment, so I made a paper sign, wrote down I came from Austria in Chinese, then went out and visited everywhere. He has been in Thailand, Korea, and even Singapore, but the important reason that made him to choose Taiwan is certainly because many Taiwanese have 35 years French with me. I have friends, good friends in the company, and good friends of the client. Besides, my wife is a Taiwanese. Albert Insto personally doesn't a large medical equipment and also observes in directly progress and development of Taiwan's medical science. If you had an accident and would need to go to hospital, in the past it took 20 minutes to have the CT scan, but now it takes 10 seconds to have the CT scan. And you can know where the problem is, then you will have the treatment of patient. In the case of Taiwan continual brain drain, Albert from Austria recently built a foundation in Taiwan, also hopes to work with the partners and families in medical field in the future.